Evil has been unmasked. After a decade of destruction, the WWE Universe finally able to look into the eyes of fear itself. The following contest is the Elimination Chamber Match. The rules of the match are as follows. Four participants will be locked away in their respective pods. Two superstars will start the match in the ring. The participants will be released into the match in random order. Eliminations can take place at any time during the match. The last superstar remaining in the chamber will be declared our Elimination Chamber winner and is for the Impact Championship. Making his way to the ring from the pits of hell. Six of WWE's hungriest stars add tons of unforgiving steel and remove all the rules. That is why Elimination Chamber is so devastating. And his opponents, first from parts unknown, weighing in at 245 pounds, Doink the Clown! More than just sneaky tricks. He's coming over your way. No, no, stay away from me, you evil clown. Oh, you're right, Cole. Doink is more than just tricks. He also possesses amazing technical wrestling skills and high-flying attacks. Is he gone yet? Yeah, go ahead, Saxton. Look now. Oh, no, Corey, you lied to me. <laughs> I think Doink's pretty twisted. He likes to make kids cry. What kind of clown likes to make kids cry? Well, if it makes you feel any better, Saxton, Doink also enjoys making adults cry and weep at the suffering he is about to inflict on his opponent. The mysterious Uncle Howdy has arrived. A frightening vision from the psyche of Bray Wyatt. There is a true aura of unpredictability surrounding Uncle Howdy. Sneak attacks, mind games. And what's even scarier is thus far, we don't know what his target is. It seems like Howdy's just out to sow the seeds of chaos. message of rebel and what you are yeah but cole what does that even mean is he talking about releasing your inner darkness well w whatever it means i'm sure it's probably bad here we go guys
Byron, given how daring he's been of late, there's almost no telling what he'll do here tonight. And that's what's so exciting about watching him compete. He's just so unpredictable. You never know what he'll pull out of his back pocket next. The nightmare has manifested itself in reality. When there's no more room in hell, the fiend will rule the earth. But before Bray Wyatt actually tamed this part of his psyche, we knew The Fiend was nearly unbeatable. As The Fiend, Bray Wyatt was able to defeat the likes of Finn Balor, Seth Rollins, Braun Strowman, even John Cena. It also brought him the Universal title. Yeah, but here's the scary question. What is The Fiend here for now? His connection with the WWE Universe has also grown. After taking out legends like Jerry Lawler, Mick Foley, Kurt Angle, competitors like Seth Rollins, all have fallen victim to the incapacitating mandible claw of The Fiend. From Death Valley, weighing in at 330 pounds, The Undertaker! Fellas, I've been looking forward to this match for a while, mostly because I'm outside the Elimination Chamber and not in it. Starting as one of the superstars in the ring is one thing. You know what you have to do, but what about the superstars that start in the pods, Byron? It's all about a game plan. It's about understanding when you're in your pod, looking at how the action is breaking down, understanding what you need to do once you get into this incredibly difficult match. Saxton, everyone has a plan until they get hit in the mouth. That certainly applies here. Corey makes a good point. Plans are one thing, but reality has a way of intruding. 
Oh, oh look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. And he was ready for Undertaker. Tossed into the corner. Splash in the corner. The opponent ducks the line right across body. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. The pot is open. But Uncle Howdy can now get into this elimination chamber match. Big boot. Oh, clothesline. Vicious right forearm. impressive agility, Undertaker unable to avoid that. The Fiend might have just made a big opportunity for himself. Oh, God! <laughs> Scoop slam! Leg drop across the throat! And a clothesline! Right into the corner. Oh, an overhand punch. Look who's next into the bedroom of the chamber. Down to Odin. And a double axe handle smash. And finds a counter. An elimination match brings its own set of struggles for the superstars, doesn't it, Corey? Absolutely, Cole. These matches can take everything out of you, both physically and mentally. The main thing is to be vigilant and knowing where your opponents are at all times. Lands face first. Oh, a knee. Lights out. is Kane, and he's going to leave it all inside the chamber. On the outside now. No place is safe in the elimination chamber, but the outside is especially dangerous. He returns to the ring. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Oh, man, that's an esophagus. Connects. Boom! Oh, a strong impact! Setting up for something here. Turning the Look out. Dunk the Clown is out of the pod and set to attack. Submission is in, but not done just yet. Elbow throw saying not today. Slam. Oh, what power! Just a power driver. What devastation from the Undertaker. Ooh, he caught him right in the face. Impact in the corner. Toe-to-toe -to -toe with a resistance he didn't expect. Double 
choke slam. And that was a rough landing from that toss. And he had Uncle Howdy's number. Oh, man, taking it to the trachea. Oh, Blackjack. Gosh, landing face first. Snapman takeover, followed by. Superstar, and I like it. Chop block without warning. Turns it around. Soul of foot meets the stomach. Jaw shattering boot. He has a right where he wants him. Top position to be caught it on the top. Now here's Fiend. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Oh. Just blasting back with an elbow to the face. Wow, clubbing blow to the back. These men are showing everyone the design. Oh, gosh, this is uncomfortable to watch. Paralysis is setting in. No, no. Bring out the hook. Doink's done. Oh, he's shoving it down his throat. Forget about it. Good night. Oh, that's got to end it this time around. Set right into the corner. 
If this connects, it is over. The final four superstars in the chamber, still a bit far from the finish. Power slam! Oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? And he may have felt his grip slipping, so he releases the hole. Still was able to produce some considerable damage though. Here we are, a triple threat-like dynamic for the last three competitors in this Elimination Chamber match. And Uncle Howdy landing another big hit in the late stages. Howdy appears to have all the stamina to go the distance. Oh, it is aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Ooh. Big shot in the face. And a big oh. boot. Oh, oh, man. The advantage is turned toward Uncle Howdy. Nothing for Dork to laugh about here. Oh no. From behind. Oh boy. Reverse choke slam. In the face. This superstar has a hold of the leg going round and round. Ouch. Right down on the leg. Oh, a numbing blow to the chest. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, Ooh. what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? He must have had that scouted. Pulled in from belly to belly. That's one way to bring your opponent to their feet. Oof! Nasty. Uncle Howdy getting worked on right now. Doink isn't oh, holding Howdy. anything back. Only one elimination left in this match. Who's going to take the victory here? There's a snapmare. And a basement drop kick. Saw it coming. Oh, knee right through the stomach. Now that'll do some serious damage. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Kane, uh oh. Oh boy. No way. Kane is our new champion. A great blend of tenacity and physical skill brings home the gold. Winning a championship in WWE is no small feat. Take a look at the new champ.